Hi everyone and welcome to German House Reaction. It's May 10th. Alright, so how many times can they say the Jew? Because it's seriously ridiculous already. It's bad enough they're plugging a show that took over another soap opera, but now they have to say the name of it like a hundred thousand times in one episode. I should have been counting because it was literally ridiculous. It's like every other word. And Nicholas is still ridiculous. I mean, holding Tracy against her will? Mm, ridiculous and, ugh, you know, doing that because... Elizabeth doesn't want her on the show. Still not romantic, Nicholas. Still still creepy and not romantic. And uh, Liz, on a uh, better note, she totally personified me with putting the cookies in the purse. Because, come on, that's just what I would do if there were free cookies right there. I mean, who wouldn't? Who wouldn't? Okay, so Morgan and Michael. I See, this is what's kind of bothering me. Now, I obviously know Morgan's grew up and everything. And it's not that. It's that his attitude, like, the whole who Morgan was has totally changed, and you could tell from when he was talking to Michael, like, that just wasn't Morgan, how I remember him, you know? I mean, obviously, I know he got older, been through more, but still, it's just not how I remember him, and it just kind of really saddens me, you know? And, you know, Morgan was right about Michael being a horrible liar. I mean, we've all seen it. Michael does not know how to lie, which is ridiculous because look who his parents are <laughs> now duke and anna in past in the past i've said that they're making this absolutely way too hard on themselves so she anna and today seeing them they're so cute it was just so easy it was so nice and especially when they were looking at what was going on with the tj molly rape situation it made me laugh because i was like they're adults and they're like oh what's going on over there because that's totally how i would be okay now with the tj molly rape situation I, first of all, ridiculous, and I love how strong Molly was, that she was, like, intent on telling the commissioner, even when Rafe and TJ was telling her not to, because that's just, you know, shout out to who she is, and then TJ confessed, but he's like, oh, but it was his fault. Yeah, TJ, definitely his fault that you lured him somewhere and punched him. No, not his fault. Your fault for being ridiculous. And I am so glad Molly's like, I'm not going to prom with you now. Because you know what? That's what needs to be done. He doesn't deserve it. Okay? I know. I don't, I don't know what this hand thing is. I will just put it away. <laughs> and, um, I, I just, a, a quick little thing. When Carly barged into Sam's apartment and was like, um, what did she say? Something about Anna will help her. Oh, in regard to Anna will help her, she's like, her grand her granddaughter goes off to feed a duck and the whole town mobilizes. Seriously, I love this show because it has the best one-liners sometimes. All right, I will see you Monday for more General Hospital. If you're wondering why there wasn't one yesterday, I didn't get a chance to watch it till late and then I just didn't upload. So I will see you Monday for more General Hospital and I hope you have a great day. Okay.